Hey everyone, it's me, Samtron. Do you have a broken NES system laying around somewhere at your house? Don't worry, everybody does. But there is hope. You can fix it yourself with just one tool and one part. I'm going to show you exactly how to do this in this video. So, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, to repair your Nintendo Entertainment System, you're going to need three things. One, your Nintendo. Two, a 72-pin connector, and three, a Phillips screwdriver. The first step is you're going to need to open up your Nintendo Entertainment System. You're going to do that by holding down your Phillips screwdriver into the holes that are at the bottom of the Nintendo Entertainment System. You're going to want to unscrew all of these so that you can open it up. have that completed, you're going to want to flip it over and open it up. Ooh, this one's nasty. I got this one from work, by the way. This is one that somebody actually traded into it. The next thing you're going to want to do is take out all the screws that you pretty much see on here. and set that aside. After that, you're going to want to take the cradle off. So you're going to do some more unscrewing. one thing that you're going to want to remember when you're fixing your Nintendo. These long screws go right here. There's one that goes right here, and then there's one that goes right here. The long one goes right here. Make sure you remember that, or else you're going to screw it up when you're trying to put it back together. So always remember that the long one goes right here. You see where the silver one is? Bam, right there. Don't mess it up. Off. See? That's where you put your Nintendo game. You want to set that aside? Now, you're going to want to take this off. This is old, and it's a piece of crap. And actually, you can fix this, too, but I'm going to show you 
how to put a new one on. You're going to open up your new one. And you're going to place it right there. This part goes right here where this screw is. This is where the long screw is going to go, and you're going to put it in there. You want this part to be the lowest part. You want it to be actually touching this board right here. And you're just going to want to push that on there. Make sure it's fit onto there. And there you go. The next thing you're going to want to do is put this cradle right back on there. It's easier if you just lift it up and flip it back on there. Line it up. Make sure it's lined up there correctly. Put it right back there on its spot, and there you go. Now before you put it back together, you're going to want to test it out to make sure that it works. I think I'm going to test it with this game, Gradius. Okay, so I have my Nintendo all set up and ready to test it out to see if it works. Now you're going to want to um, make sure that it's open still before you actually test it out, just in case you do it wrong or something, because then you'll have to reopen it back up and do it all over again. So let's test it out and see if it works. Oh man, it works! And you can be doing this too. Okay, so now that you know for sure that it is working, you can start putting it back together. Make sure that you put these ones in first. You want to put it in order exactly the way that it was before. Put the cradle back on first. enjoyed my instruction session on how to fix your Nintendo Entertainment System. So go out there and fix your Nintendo Entertainment System so you can get back to gaming. See you guys later. Bye.